everyone, welcome or welcome back here to my channel where I play Planet Soup. My name is Nissa and today we're gonna take a look at the Asian Golden Cat by Mansoon and Frazzle. Uh, again, I don't know Frazzle, and, but I know a bit about Mansoon's mutts at this part. Um, and they're usually very good, so I feel like we are in good hands here. The Asian Golden Cat is the Asian version of the Golden Cat. We also have an African Golden Cat. We're gonna take a look at it later today. Uh, we're gonna put up three videos today because someone got the idea of putting in extra mutts this week that we need to get out there. Uh, we don't need to, but I really want to. Um, so uh, to have time for it all, we're gonna do it this way. Um, the Asian Golden Cat is, as you see on the picture here below me, have this burnt orange color uh, that varies a little. I have seen some of them being a little more, oh, we got kittens there, a little more brown toned or a little more yellow toned, but oh, well, most of them has this very burnt orange color. We have the stripe down in the face, both with lighter and darker spot, uh, stripes and the same out here in the mustache. And then we have down uh, on the declache, I think it's called, and the belly. We have this lighter color with, again, these stripy spotty thingies at the side uh, of it. And then the uh, paws inner side of the legs and the paws turn to gray. Um, yeah, we're gonna jump over here and i think we're gonna jump right into superior and i actually just gonna stop the time now because i want the kittens to stay as young as possible because i'm gonna show you stuff uh they are near threatened and there are an estimated ten thousand of them left in the wild we they, we are in asia asian golden ti tiger golden cat so yeah uh, Nepal, India, Bhutan, Bangladesh, Myanmar, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, Vietnam, China, Mal Malaysia. I was almost there. And Sumatra. Um, we are in tropical and temperate biome. And one of them need 300 square meters of land. 55 of climbable area. And they do swim. They don't need water, but they do swim if you let them. Not a lot. They honestly stay up in the climbing area unless they need to go pooping, go eating, go drinking, or go playing. Uh, otherwise, they stay up here all the time, which I kind of are into. Because a lot of the climbing animals we have in the game don't really climb that much. Um, you need a great two climbable fence. Not climbable. Climb proof <laughs> uh, at least 10 meters, so that's just above, th uh, sorry, 10 feet, so that's just above 3 meters. And jumping in here, you can have one male, one female, or one of each. No dominance, promiscuous, shy around humans, and guests should not enter the habitat. And I love this. Every mother do like this. I love it. They are. Uh, 56 centimeters at the shoulder or 22 inch they live for around 20 years and the male weigh around uh, 16 kilos that's 32 pounds and a kilo less for the females that's two pounds less uh, age of sexual maturity a year and a half and the sexual sterilization at 18 years they get between one and three Oh, sorry, one and five kittens every other year, and they are pregnant for three months. They should be quite difficult to get to reproduce in captivity, but we got this. Um, no interspecies enrichment jumping over here. They have almost the same enrichments that, that the cl clouded leopard have, but not quite, so we're gonna go over it. We have this ha hammock. Ham hammock, yeah. Uh, again, I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. We have the two scratching trees, scratching pole, scratching pad, but only the one variation. All three of the small balls, the rubber doggy, blood scent marker, and the, um, uh, what's it called, uh, ice block. 
and then the both of the cardboard boxes and the sprinkler. We have two food enrichments, so we have the zebra piada, only the zebra one, and then we have the uh, a frozen blood pumpkin over here. Oh, you're not gonna fall that, I thought you were. So, why don't we just let them come to us? And here we have a swimmer. The babies swim quite well. The adult are placed a little bit weird in the water. Um, and the same when they're drinking, kind of dip the whole head down in the water because the rig apparently think they are taller than they actually are. Um, but we, if we let them go for the food, then maybe we can take a look at them at the same time. That didn't help me a lot. Would you please look up? Would you look up? Mm -hmm. Well, I can tell you my issue here. The babies are born this side. You can see here. The babies are way too big compared to the adult. And this have another issue that we're gonna come into later. I'm gonna stop them right here because then I can show you. Here we have it. And I'm just gonna pull off the picture again. Here. And you can see they got the stripe and the sweaty. It is a bit blurry. That's the fluffiness issue from the game. So that's not the mother's fault at all. Uh, but we hit the coloration quite well actually uh, again on the picture below it seems like the sun is hitting real hard on the one side so look at the uh, right side on the picture you can see there on the shoulder it's much closer to the same color we have beautiful eyes we have uh, here the drawings also fit very nicely we have the chest they seem a little more stripy on this than it does on the picture um, but that's not a big issue. And then we have some lighter spots in here, which we really can't see if it has. Um, and then the kind of thick tail compared with the cat size. Uh, over here, and we have the grayish paw. So overall, they hit it very well. Um, but I will say though, even though we have that fluffy nose issue, you can clearly see that they have painted on every single strand of hair here, which are very well done. We also have so many different colorations inside of the eye. We have both the whiskers and the eyebrow hairs, uh, which are real nice details. So overall, they look very good. I'm just going to move you a little bit. Now, back to the size issue with the babies. These looks like kittens. We can all agree of that. They really... Sorry, my chair is noisy. Um, this looks so much like a kitten and it's so well done. It even got the blue eyes, which a lot of animals actually start out with blue eyes and then they change over time. Some humans actually also do that, so they get born with blue eyes and then they get brown or green eyes later on. Um, it have the kitten drawing, I don't have a picture of that, but the drawings and the kittens are a little bit different and they are lighter in color as they should be. The issue here, besides the sizing, is that kittens have parts that are fully grown. They normally have that, so they have their eyes looks too big, the ears looks too big, and the nose not the entire uh, snout, but the nose itself here looks too big for the face, which are why they look so much like kittens. They should do that, but when they are born this big, the size of this ear is bigger than these are ears. And then it becomes a problem where the ears won't shrink over time. They just stay the same size. So the head will grow into the ears that way. Um, but over here, they are way too big compared to this. They should have this size of ears, that which seems too big to the face it have. But because they are made too big here, 
it it doesn't really connect to the adult golden cat this isn't an issue you have if you just play the game like i i i pretty much be built i love different animals i love to learn about them you know that but i'm not sitting for hours staring at the same animal some of you do and that's also okay but if you really want to look at really small kittens you won't get that here if you just want to build for a gold asian golden cat real badly then you can't get that here so again choosing your mud are really much about what you want to do with it um now i i made a video for the fishing cat earlier and the kittens are also big there so i don't know if there's a block somewhere in the game that cats can't get that small but it seems to be an overall problem though the animation of the kittens are very cute especially if they run that was a adult running yeah and the sound is so cute I think I have added sound so you can hear the sound. That's also actually why I don't have music on now. Um, please tell me if you like that better. I really like to make these videos so they fit your uh, your needs. And um, they are to help you pick the right mats. So um, please tell me. They're so cute. And just looking at this, this is a, the perfect kitten mud. Uh, keep in mind the glitching you can see here that might be my computer and not the game um, it's only when you see them together the issue is but uh, I'm honestly gonna stay quiet now because I have told you all I have to tell you about this mod so uh, yeah you know the real guys like subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you know the next time I upload a video I really hope to see you again, other in the comments below or in the next video. Bye guys!